Dragonair 34 here, and as you can see, I just got 70 defense. So that's awesome. Now I can wear Armadil, um, and that means that I am going to try Jad for a Fire Cape. So yeah, that's going to be pretty awesome. I'm going to try to do it before the EOC, because um, I'm not very good at the uh, beta, playing on the beta, so with all those abilities and confusing stuff, but I'm sure I'll get used to it, so that's okay. Um, yeah, so I got 70 defense, and so now in this video I'll kind of be telling you what exactly Road to Awesome is, because it's kind of not very defined awesome, you know, what does that mean? Um, so, as you can see on the screen, I'll be putting up the goals of the series. So, all of these are subject to change because of the EOC and just other reasons. Maybe I thought that it was going to be easier than it actually is. But anyway, so first, um, I think I said this in the first episode, um, 1800 total level. I don't think that's going to be too hard, but maybe a little. Um, right now I have 1553, and I did get a couple new levels. I got um, some crafting and various things. If you really want to know, then you can look yourself. Um, I did quite a few quests, and I'm... So that leads us on to our next goal. Um, 100 quest points. I really hate quests, to be honest. So that's why I have under a head 100, so don't make fun of me for that. Um, let's see how many I have. I think I have around 90... 89. So I have 89 quest points. So 20 quest points, that may not seem like a lot, but since I do quests like once in every five months, maybe, that's a lot. So, so um, also next... Um, a purple party hat. So, right now my bank is like 450 mil, I think. I'm not sure exactly, but um, let's. I'm just gonna take a random guess. But that won't be very definite. It'll just kind of be more like more cash, because I don't usually buy things to keep, like bandos or stuff like that. So my cash is pretty much always the same. It steadily goes up. Well, I hope that it steadily goes up. Um, all right, so anyway, next, um, kill necks. And so as a little subscript to this, um, I want to kill all of the God Wars dungeon bosses. So um, also, all right, next, I want to uh, get a fire cape, and I might be doing that relatively soon, or I would hope so. Uh, I might not record during that because it uh, fraps lags RuneScape quite a bit, so uh, I don't want to mess up with prayer switches. I was thinking about using a death touch dart, but I'm not sure if it's worth it to use one of those um, on just Jad instead of like Nex or something. Uh, I did. I tried uh, Jad on a private server with my exact stats and the gear that I would be using, and I got the fire cape. Uh, so I might not use it, but I don't know. I just maybe to make sure. I'll probably try it once without them, and if I epically fail, then I'll use it. Um, alright, next. Uh, a chaotic, um, weapon. Uh, I'm not sure of how they're going to be buffed up or nerfed after the EOC, and I'm obviously not going to get 80 Dungeoneering before the EOC, so I'll just have to see on that one. Uh, I hate Dungeoneering as well, so, uh, I might never get that, so that might change as well. If the weapons are really, like, nerfed, then I might just get rid of that goal. Because I'm not going to work that hard to get something that isn't even good. So next, um, 5 mil shards. So right now I have I have 1.7 mil shards. Um, it's, it may seem like, oh, well, you all can already buy that. But what I do is I, I don't know why I don't have one in now. I pretty much always have an offer in for spirit shards. So I buy, uh, since you can only buy 10k every 4 hours, I buy uh, uh, a total of 60k per day. And so I usually put an offer of like 100k or something for 24 GP. And then by the end, I will have made, oh, uh, by the end of that, I will have made 5 mil because I'm going to go to Taverly and sell them for 25 each. So I make 1 GP each. That's pretty good. I mean, it's not good money or anything, but better than no money. So, final shards, that's kind of like a thing that's just going to happen, you know, over time. 
I can't. It's just going to be through every four hours I'll buy them. Um, and yeah, so those are the goals right now. And also under um, 1800 total level, kind of like a sub subscript to that, um, 50, like so 50, at least 50 in every skill. I'm almost to that, so I might just change that to 60. Um, the only ones I have left are Herblore, that's really close, and I have a Botanist's top from the Squeal of Fortune, so that's nice. Runecrafting, Rune Span, it makes it relatively easy, although it was nerfed, that kind of sucks. And Dungeoneering, I'm just really close, couple dungeons on that. So um, that will probably change to 60 pretty soon, and then maybe 70 or 65, I don't know. I'm not very good at training skills, so we'll have to see. And also, um, Lunar Diplomacy. I want to complete Lunar Diplomacy. That's why I was questing a couple days ago. And that's where I even got the ideas of quest points. Otherwise, I would have never done that. Um, so, yeah. That's what my goals are going to be for the Road to Awesome. So, it might not... if in Like the next episode, it might not be... Oh, I got five quest points, five levels, 200k shards, and something or another. Um, it, it might just be... Oh, I just got like 75 strength or something it might not be all on one because i don't know how some people do it like rune shark and the maxed people they like gain 50 99s in like three seconds but i don't know i'm i'm not like pro so yeah so uh i'll might be making a road to awesome now that you actually know what it is um pretty soon after i attempt jad so until then, I'll see you later.